So our WCCO viewers just keep showing up in a major way, and we are seeing that difference in North Minneapolis. Oh, we are. Scholarship program is growing bigger and bigger. More students are getting help, and it's all thanks to you. Our Shayla Reeves joins us now live in studio, breaking it all down for us. Shayla, good morning. Good morning. Don't you like some happy news? Yes, right. yes, yes, we do. I love when my phone rings for some happy news. <laughs> well, you never know how a story is going to connect with mm -hmm. someone until you get that unexpected call. So that's what happened to Tito Wilson, the owner of Wilson's Image Barbers mm -hmm. and Stylists and the founder of the Wilson's Image College Scholarship Program. He says he was sitting at home with his wife, answered a call, connected with a WCCO viewer wanting to make Happy a $10,000 donation. He told me, you know, he had seen a story on, on WCCO and, you know, he had some money that he wanted to do something with. And, you know, he had been holding his money for a while. He wanted to take this money and do something impactful with it, but he just didn't know until he saw the story. So the viewer did not wish to be identified, but we're told his family did have some ties to education. Tito says the scholarship program has raised almost a hundred thousand dollars. They will help nearly 20 students since starting back in 2018. Right. Um, and just this week, I was sitting at home one afternoon, phone rings, mm -hmm. Tito, <laughs> yeah, again, he said, you're not going to believe this. And I said, what? Mm -hmm. He said, a banking partner made a $10,000 donation. This is another relationship he's been building wow. in the community yeah. on his own, unrelated to this story. So his ultimate goal is to be able to provi provide students in North Minneapolis with full ride scholarships mm. and just uh, the community wrapping their arms around oh, yeah. him. Mm -hmm. He's well on his way, hopefully, to doing that yeah. in the future. And I, I understand we said someone saw your original stories yeah. and, you know, you had interviewed some of these students mm -hmm. and how it impacted them. Yes. And it was so powerful to hear them, to yeah. hear them mm -hmm. and hear what kind of difference this made. So it doesn't surprise me that someone saw that and said, this is where I want my money to go. I know. And this is this is all about relationship building, yeah. because these aren't just kids that are coming in the door for the scholarship. These are kids that he has seen. He cut their hair when they were children. He's known their, their parents. Mm -hmm. right. He's seen them grow up. Up, yeah. and their journey evolve in the person that they're yeah. they're now and the person they're going to become. It's mm -hmm. just, it's beautiful. We we'll <laughs> have to see what these students do and maybe these students, they come back to the North Minneapolis community and say, you know yes. what, now I want to invest yeah. in our community too. Yeah, All right, so Shayla, true. Great mm -hmm. stuff, thank you. Thanks. Mm -hmm.